with uh, Sigma Nu being founded in opposition to hazing, what is your response to anyone in the room who might be quietly thinking that hazing should be justified just because the military does it? Well, I don't, uh, I don't think that uh, we have a big problem with hazing in the military anymore. I think in years past we did in the Marines and the Army. Uh, but you see these movies where uh, the drill instructor is up in the face of a soldier and uh, in some cases he's uh, making vulgar remarks to him and everything. I, I would never put up with that. I, I never would put up with anything that demeaned a soldier because we have an all-volunteer army now and if a kid volunteers to be in my army and serve with me, I'm going to treat him like the man that he is. No, I agree. I've been very much opposed to this and I when I was in, with a ranger school as, a, as an instructor, one of the things I had to watch very closely was the younger instructors who would have potential for hazing because all of the rangers that came through took off all their ranks, so everybody was a ranger. They were, whether they were a major or a lieutenant or a sergeant or whatever, they were just rangers. So some of the young instructors sometimes would sort of tend that way. Right away, you had to put a stop to it. There was nothing because you won't learn what's right, you won't learn what's good. When, these, when you're hazing people or you're putting fear into them, they're gonna turn inward. And my theory is all the time, it's, it's sort of like that turtle. You know the turtle that's got that hard shell on his back and uh, he's sort of impervious to being, being damaged. But when you hit that shell, what does he do with his legs and his neck? They pull in. And where do you go when your neck is in and your legs are in? Nowhere. So fear, hazing, don't belong. We need soldiers that are ready to take that risk and to go out and do things. And that's the same thing with you. You will take risk. You've got to take risk or you'll go nowhere. 